Welcome to this video on how to quickly customize one of the new formatted newsletters that you received. So here's the, the issue that just came out. This is in my email. Uh, so this is just like you will receive it. Uh, it'll have your newsletter name, your contact information. Uh, everything will be in it already customized for you. This is ready to go. If you wanted to, you could send this out almost right now and I'll show you how. But if you notice, I can't make any changes because this is just in my inbox. So now it's time to make some customization and send it out. So you start with forward. So I hit forward. Now at this point, we are ready. I mean, I could very easily do a couple, delete this right here because you don't want that in there and then send it out. But I'm gonna show you a little bit more about that. But let's just step, step right through this. So first off, I want this to be a test email. I'm gonna send it to myself, make sure it looks good. I suggest everybody doing that. Um, but when you're ready to send it, let's say you've got it, you're ready for this thing to go. You're going to come up here to, and this is using Outlook. We're going to come up to CC and click on find your contacts and then use this BCC, which is blind carbon copy. And this way, nobody that gets this sees all of everybody else's names. You don't ever want that. That's unprofessional. It does not look right. And you're giving away your contacts. Not good. So uh, but don't even use CC. You never want it in the two area. You don't want it in the CC. It's always in that BCC, blind carbon copy area. But of course, this is a test, so I don't want it to go there. Uh, next thing you want to do, get rid of that FW, which means forward. I don't want to do that. I don't want that. I just want the name of this particular newsletter right there. Uh, the other thing I want to make sure I point out is this area right here. Make sure you read the before you send instructions. Uh, when using Outlook or Gmail or those, just so you are aware of what to watch for. All right, so of course we don't want this in when it goes to our clients and our prospects, so I'm gonna just hit delete. This thing's ready to roll. You could actually hit send right now and it's ready to go. But I wanna show you just a couple more quick things to do. Um, that if you if you choose, you can do these. Uh, but I wanted to make this picture a little bit thinner, so I'm gonna do that. You can always delete that picture, put a different picture there, or just have it gone all together and maybe put your logo there. Uh, it's completely up to you. It's formatted, ready to be easily uh, changed. This is what I call like the newsletter name area. And uh, I'm actually going to get rid of that and put a picture to show you how to insert a picture. And I'm going to put my logo there. So I insert my logo and there it is. Uh, this is what we call our slogan or model tagline, if you will. Uh, if you want to change this, you can. Uh, I'm going to change it to putting your marketing on, I don't know. <laughs> How's that? Um, but you don't have to change this. If it's something you want different than what I put in there already for you, just let me know. And I can make the change at this end and you won't have to change it each month. But you are welcome to change that at any given time. And then you come up here and I've, I put this in together, shaping the future. Um, but, you know, I want to change that to, uh, let's see, I'm just going to, just shaping the future. So there, that's done. And from the desk of Gary Sorrell, here's my my mug. You can delete that if you don't want your, your that would be where your picture is, by the way, not mine. If you don't want it, just hit delete. Uh, if you want to leave it in there, leave it in there. Here's a nice little greetings and thank you. Uh, you can make that change, type in it, do whatever you want. And then we get into the article. How to improve communication in the workplace is this article. You read through it, you see it, you love it. Um, if you wanna type in anything else, you are more than welcome to just start typing away. It's very easy to do. I made it so you could easily, easily make changes to this. So just know that going into it. Um, and then, so there it is, it's all ready to roll. Uh, here's a quote that I've got in there from Brian Tracy, but I'm actually, I don't want that quote. I want to show you how to take that out. So the quote's gone. Maybe you want to put another quote there. Uh, you know what? Maybe you want to put a, a link to a video. I don't know. Uh, click here for our, well, if I could spell, huh? Click here for our video testimonial. So I'm going to link. I'm going to actually put a live link here and I want to come up here. I want to find that link. I'm going to highlight this. I'm going to right click, go to hyperlink. Sorry, I know I'm moving quickly, but I just want you to see very quickly how easy this is to do. And there it is. I'm going to, I'm, this is a target frame. I want it to open in a new window, in a new browser. And I'm just going to hit OK. There's the live link. It's ready to go. 
Uh, this area, you know, it's got your name, which I've made this sample, and it's got my name. Uh, your company information will be here, your address will be here, uh, your website's here, your email's here, phone number, anything else that you want there can be there. Uh, and let's say you don't want my copyright on there, that's fine, just delete it. Leave this little area, it's always good to have stuff copyrighted, so leave that in there. Uh, you can put your name wherever you want. So anyway, so this thing is ready to go. I mean, look at that, it's beautiful. It's already formatted behind the scenes what you don't see, so it, so it looks really good. So be careful if you, if you try to like move this onto this side you know, and doing, doing weird things like this, you might, might cause you some problems. So be careful with that, but you're good to go. I mean, it's ready to roll, and now it's time to send. So I'm going to go ahead, hit send, and this is my test, so it's going to go to me. Here's the one that's in my email box, and I'm just going to X out of that. I'm going to open up my email here, go to, yeah, I sent it to Gary at, so I'm going to hit send and let's see if we can find it. And there it is. How to improve communications. And it, see, I, I've got my Outlook set up to send a, a receipt, a red receipt. I, that's in mine. That's a setting that we have on each one of ours, um, our Outlooks. But here it is. Here's the newsletter. Just think of how quickly we were able to make this thing work. And you know what? It's customized for you. It's ready to go. Watch this. Click here for their video testimonies. Does it work? Let's find out. Look at that. I mean, boom, we're ready to roll. And it was that fast. That fast. If you wanted to put another article in place of this or whatever, you can do anything from here. It's an awesome awesome new format and setup. It's ready to roll for you all. Uh, I hope this video helped you understand how quickly you can customize it and how customizable it really is. If you have any questions, as always, feel free to give me a call or send an email. I'll be happy to help and happy marketing. I hope you're having a great day. Take care. We'll talk soon. Thanks. Bye.